Right then guys, a little mini. Uh, now there is a, a bit of a knack apparently to starting it, or there's a, certainly a procedure. And I did a giggle yesterday. Charlie's down here today helping me do some photographs because I was working in our um, unit two here and I could hear this alarm going off down there and uh, the lads uh, were all trying to work out how you stop it. So um, Charlie just said, there's a bit of a knack to starting this. And I said, well, have a go. Uh, we haven't done a pre-run. We've just pushed it this morning. So go for it, mate. While I'm videoing and walking around, you oh, see if there's a bit of a procedure. Apparently there's, I'm guessing there's the factory yeah, immobilizer and an, 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 an additional yeah, look, one. There's two fobs. Yeah, the, yeah. That one is to whatever. Yeah, lock it, unlock it, whatever. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, okay. Right, maybe shut the door, it might like it. Yeah, maybe just try using the factory one, maybe not. Oh, I'll leave it to you, anyway. They obviously got it going yesterday because they drove it up from unit, well, watched Andy drive it in. They drove it up from uh, unit uh, one up to unit two. Uh, right, he's got the factory one off because I can see the light's gone out on the dash. Hey, there you go, there you go. I'm sure it'll be very, very simple. It's just that when you don't know the car and it's just landed and it's got two immobilizers on it. Um, yeah, so uh, I'm sure, I mean, then Charlie there pressed a couple of buttons and instantly started first touch of the key. So um, there you go. So I'll ask him to show you when you come down. But there she is, she looks well. It sounded quite fit yesterday when it drove up into this unit with Andy. Charlie's taken a load of photographs for you. I'll have a walk around while we're here now. So all good around the headlamp there, A panel good. Door bottom there, that's nice, all around the car there. Good in the boot lid. Been, uh, she's got Cupress badges, twin fillers there. We'll continue round. All good down this side, door bottom's good. Just a very little bit just underneath the paint just there, being critical. But I know a lot of you guys tend not to travel and just go by our videos and things, which is great, but that's why we, we do a warts and all video uh, with everything. Uh, to the point where sometimes we'll get a vendor ring up and complain and say that video is not very flattering. Well, the video is what it is, you know. I, I can't do anything other than show people what it is and I won't do anything other than show people what it is. And Jack's the same, my lad Jack, and we all are. You know, if we see that something's quite right, we'll show you guys. There's no point in you travelling all the way up from Derby and then find out that something's not quite right. It wouldn't, the, uh, the vendor wouldn't like it if it was the other way around. Not in this case, I'm not suggesting it with a Mini for one moment. So there we are. So hopefully that's giving you a bit of an insight as to what we've got here now. Size comparison. I know, yeah. <laughs> fancy, isn't she? Very fancy. Right. So we'll park it up in a minute. I don't know quite where, Charlie. I'll tell you what, Charlie, just back it round in front of that Mercedes. That'll do there for now. Yeah, we're starting to get full now. We've got quite a few in the building uh, coming along nicely. The other building's best part full. We normally fill this big unit up. Yeah, put it in front of that silver Mercedes there, mate, in front of the MG. Yeah, might as well, Bob, it just there for now. Um, but it was just so the way it's worked, this last couple of weeks, we've been uh, we've been busy down at our original unit one down there, and got that filled up, and now we're working on unit two. So yeah, there's not a lot wrong with that, guys, is there? Bonny looking little thing. Yeah, that's it, mate. Left hand down. Yep, yeah, straight up. There we are. That'll do for me. So there you are guys, we always have quite a few minis kicking around. So uh, there's one of them, bright looking thing. Feel free to come down after Christmas and have a look.